What's up, I am Richard. it's Ike Paws, and today I'm gonna to show you, give you a little tutorial on how to use my pin keyword finder. You see this little Chrome tool I had developed for myself. I'm giving away for free. <clears throat> There's a link somewhere in this video or down below. Make sure you pick it up. I'm gonna show you how to use it right now, okay? It's a really powerful tool, okay? Before, this is why I had this created. Before, I'd have to get into the Pinterest search bar. I'd have to write in, a keyword I was interested in, landing page. Remember, the Pinterest search engine and the Google search engine are different, so it's not always the same. So you'd have to type in your keyword within the Pinterest search engine. <clears throat> then you'd have to copy the, la for example, landing page plus design, landing page plus inspiration, landing page plus template. And you'd have to copy and paste every single keyword right in there, not anymore. With my Google, no, not Google, with my pin keyword finder, <clears throat> all you gotta do is put the keyword you're interested in inside the search bar, and you will have all of the relevant most searched for keywords on the very on the very front page. All you gotta do is copy, copy, and then paste it within your within your image, your Pinterest image. Let me show you how it's done, okay? So you wanna create a description, okay? So I'd go to my account real quick, let me show you. Um, and I'm going to add a Pinterest bin. I'm gonna to go to a board and I'm going to not create a board, but uh, create a pin, okay? I'm gonna show you also a different way of doing things. Actually, let me go to the top because that usually it, that's the easiest place to, to put in your pin. See right here, create pin. Click create pin, okay? I'm doing this live stream, so it might take a little bit, but I want you to watch this video in its entirety. I'm gonna show you how you do things, how I get traffic from Pinterest, okay? Now, usually back in the day, I would just drop my pin, here's my pin, my new pin, drop it in here, and I would fill this out, okay? So I'd fill this out, so with the information I have here, right? With the, with the keywords I got from my pin keyword finder. Here are 30 landing page templates. This is a keyword rich description because we know the keywords that people use to search landing pages within the Pinterest search engine, right? These Here are 30 landing page templates uh, that are pre-designed there is no need to design them yourself there are over 30 different landing page designs that will inspire you to create high converting squeeze pages and sales pages. Um, besides that, I also like to add a hashtag, maybe one or two at max, okay, with the keyword, okay? So landing page and landing page template, okay? But you might be saying to yourself, um, you, you, now it's time to pin this pin uh, image to your uh, to your Pinterest, but no, I, I don't use the actual Pinterest dashboard. I use Tailwind. I'm gonna go back to that. I'm gonna come back here, right here, okay? So, instead of actually pinning this within Pinterest, I go to Tailwind. Now, why do I use Tailwind, and why don't I use Pinterest itself? Very easy, okay, let me explain. Within Tailwind, 
I get all of my pins, all of my pins, all of my Pinterest pins, and all of the people that I'm I'm pinning, repinning. I get it all done automatically. Everything's pre-scheduled. Everything is done, done for you. Okay. So once you upload your pin, I'm actually I'm actually gonna I'm actually going to copy this. Okay. I'm gonna actually copy this, and I'm going to delete this uh, this uh, this tab right here. So I can add it to my Tailwind account. I'm gonna show you how it's done. Okay. There it is. It's gonna upload right now. This allows me not only to add it to my Pinterest account on multiple group boards and within multiple boards, but also I can add it to Tailwind Tribes, which is an added bonus because these are people like me who are serious about getting traffic from Pinterest, okay? So I use my pin keyword finder, which is a free piece of software I had created for myself in conjunction with Tailwind. So I'm gonna drop the description I wrote a little bit ago, and I'm gonna add all the groups that I'm, I'm gonna be sharing this with, okay? I'm gonna be sharing this with all the groups here, okay? I'm also gonna be sharing this in relevant boards of mine, which would be, of course, Internet Marketing uh, Gym. That's my, that's my main board. It would also be um, Email Marketing, because ultimately, you, you wanna create opt-in pages with my landing pages to collect emails. Also, make money online makes sense, okay? Also, I wanna add it to Twitter. I wanna add it to Facebook, okay? Now, this, this tool does not spam. It knows exactly when to send it out, when to upload it to Pinterest, to Facebook, to Twitter, and it does it at the high engagement points of your Pinterest account, which is the coolest function in my, in, uh, the coolest feature in my opinion, okay? So now all I have to do is add the link to where I wanna send this traffic. I'm gonna send this traffic to a squeeze page, okay? Usually I send Pinterest image traffic to squeeze pages and sales pages, and sometimes just free pieces of content, okay? So here is a, here is a, uh, an image about uh, landing three, 30 free landing pages and it's gonna send traffic to a squeeze page where I'm offering 30 free landing pages. Very easy to do, very easy to understand, okay? Also, I have to create an alternative Facebook. Uh, so I'm gonna add my link here. I'm gonna create an alternative Facebook um, title, okay? Grab all 30 free landing page templates uh, today, for example, okay? Now before I, I add it to my list here, which is will automatically send it out, I'm gonna add it to Tailwind Tribes first, okay? Blogging tips, uh, these are all the Tailwind Tribes that belong within my niche. I actually run and own my own uh, Tailwind Tribe called Internet Marketing Super Friends, okay? Again, everyone was in the same niche, Whatever, whatever niche you're in, there's a Tailwind tribe for it, that I can promise you, okay? I have more information down below, free trial and all that good stuff, but uh, let me go over this little tutorial real quick. So now you know how I use my pin keyword finder. Now I'm gonna do something, I'm gonna add this, okay, to my schedule right here, okay? It's gonna automatically go to my schedule, okay? And then I wanna shuffle it, okay? <clears throat> Uh, again, you know, forgive the the lag in time. It, there is a uh, there is a delay with the live streaming here. Should be done any second now. Okay. So, uh, besides that, I also want to add other people's pins. There's a good rule of thumb is to is to add eighty percent on on any given day, eighty percent of other people's pins and twenty percent of your own pins, okay? And on, on almost every day, I, I send out perhaps uh, 20 to 30 different pins. Now you can do that on your own, and I used to do that on my own actually, with, within the, the baby shower niche back in the day, but uh, I'll, tell you, I'll tell you what, it is a time killer. It takes a lot of time to do that. I highly recommend you use Tailwind Tribe because it automates the whole process for you. Yeah, okay. So, I'm gonna 
open up Tailwind again because again, it's live streaming. I want to show you not only uh, uh, you know watch me add my own pins, but I want to show you how I add other people's pins as well because it's really important to your Pinterest traffic strategy not only to add your own pins, but other people's pins. I'm going to delete this tab. I'm gonna open another tab with Tailwind Tribe. Hopefully it'll refresh everything, make everything nice. Okay, beautiful. Now I'm gonna to go to Tailwind Tribes, okay? This is very much like a pin, uh, Pinterest group board, but it's more, uh, the people in Tailwind Tribes are more, th are more serious about getting traffic, about resharing other people's pins, and about adding their own pins. So th there's more of a, a, a level of seriousness to, to Pinterest marketing because, uh, like I said, everyone who's in, in is in Tailwind uh, is actually a, either a paid member or, or they're actually trying out Tailwind for free. Okay, which you can do again. I have information down below for that. Um, I'm gonna go to right here, okay, and I'm gonna start adding these people and their pins. Okay, badass unique boutique business plan. So this person. Makes sense that I put them within the uh, my my group test group. I'm gonna put them in there. I'm gonna put that in there. Okay. I'm also gonna add. See now I'm gonna add. Um, I don't I don't like the miracle routine. I like this WordPress one, but they didn't add a description. See this is no good. They should really add a description. This is my Tailwind group, so I'm gonna I'm gonna delete this this pin because. They should have added a description, always add a description. Super important, super important when, um, when doing any type of Pinterest marketing. Okay, branding, very good, I like this one. I'm gonna add this to entrepreneurial. Okay, I'm gonna click add to add the queue. Okay, now I'm gonna go back to my schedule and I'm going to shuffle things around so that you know it doesn't appear like I'm spamming. It's really important that you shuffle. It's okay to add the same pin uh, more than once, but you gotta shuffle it around. You gotta make sure they belong in in the correct boards, right? If you, for example, if you have a if you're in the dog market and your niche is about taking uh, taking care of a dog's fur, and you have different boards for different breeds of dogs, you don't want a poodle pin within a German Shepherd pin. Now, do you? It's the same principle um, here, okay? So, <clears throat> I want to shuffle the pins that I just added. Not only my own, but the ones uh, of other people's. I'm going to click this button here. Okay, well, maybe it's gonna work. Again, the live streaming is interfering with the with the actual software, but you know, usually you just click the shuffle button. Hmm, I wanna sh maybe I can show you right now. Usually you click the shuffle Q button. Oh, here it goes. It should work now. Okay, anyways. That's how this works. You click the shuffle button and it shuffles all of the Pinterest pins for you within your account and it does this automatically without you having to pin your Pinterest pins uh, throughout the day. It saves a lot of time and it's been a, it's been a, a godsend when it comes to traffic. Um, and again, in the best part, it's automated. So I hope you like this video. Check out the information below to pick up my free pin keyword finder right here and more information on Tailwind. Uh, again, sorry for the technical difficulties. Live streaming and such makes it difficult sometimes. Take care. Don't forget to subscribe. Thank you very much. Bye-bye.